Hey, hey, what's good, guys? It's your boy Dizo, and today we're gonna be taking a look at the fourth uh, Jordan 1 Nike SB low box tag reads. Let's see Air Jordan 1 low, white, black, mystic green, blank, vert, mystique, nor size 8. Not my true to size, that's actually a half size down, but that's how I like my Jordan 1 lows. Suggested retail price. 90 bucks i say fourth because the first one was the black university gold the next one was the gum pink colorway and the last one the black toe colorway so this is the fourth uh, jordan one low nike sb let's see how it looks like outsole is that green colorway in person it's actually darker than it is what you see there you go that's that's the green i see i know in this part like right now it's reflected but whatever you see in this in this side that's not reflected that's that's how it, that's how it looks like in person back to the shoe outsole is green Midsole all white with the stitches right there stitches right on the midsole and I would like to say This is the same quality uh, Durabuck as they did with the black toes Durabuck right here and the same quality leather on the white portion as well it's not that smooth smooth leather but it is synthetic leather uh, it's kind of on the hard side I know it looks like there's creasing on it to make it look like really soft uh, but it's not I'm not sure on the other ones if how the shoot swoosh was but uh we'll take a look and see in a little bit so in the back is a stitched Air Jordan branding. Swoosh is still synthetic leather. Synthetic overlay right there. So the door box still comes up all the way to the tongue, right where the laces are at. Now this is where the difference lies. This colorway and the rest is the tongue. As you can see, it's a textured, like more like a corduroy pants would but it's a textured pants up uh, pants <laughs> I don't know why I said pants it's a textured textile linen material two three right there let's see what the inside is give me one second all right sorry about that I had to confirm with the wife. <laughs> you guys already know color blind, color blind person right here. Shit, let me. Yeah, this is just the light. So we got a pink insole right there. There you go. There you go. This is actually the first out of all the colorways that has a uh, pink insole. Yes. Let's compare this. So first we're gonna compare it with the University Gold and the Gum Pink colorway, just because of the material difference entirely. So as you can see, University Gold has all suede everywhere. All suede, except for the tongue. All suede upper. The Gum Pink. Or the pink gum colorways all suede also difference with this and university gold is the color blocking this is all one uh, same color except for the tongue and the laces there you go so both of these both of these are all suede up top 
This one has Durabuck, synthetic leather, synthetic leather overlays, and the tongue is different. Now this, this colorway is a lot closer to the black toes. All right, so now we have the black toes on deck. That was stressing out this uh, emerald or emerald green, the mystic green looks a lot closer to the black toes than the other two in the back. So here's the difference or similarities. Durabuck, oh, there you go. Durabuck right there. Durabuck on here, the leather on here. Check that out. This is the Mystic Green colorway. Same as the black toes. The swoosh on the black toe is a Durabuck material. Well, the Mystic Green colorway has a synthetic overlay. Around the back, let's check that out. They're the same. Medial part, as I've stressed out. Durabuck on the swoosh. Synthetic leather on that swoosh. And also, when I mentioned the beginning, check out the tongues on these. How different they are. This is from afar, this is up close. So the black toe has textile linen material. I wouldn't say there was there's any nylon backing that up because there's not. It doesn't feel like it. This one does though. Plus it looks like a corduroy material or a pants-like material with those uh like you, these lines, these striated lines, like you can feel them. So that's the main, main, uh, main difference, or look-wise, material-wise difference between the four Jordan One SB Lows. So there you have it, guys. The Jordan One SB Low collection for uh, 2019. I don't know if there's any other colorway that's gonna be coming out, but um, so far they had the black university gold the gum and pink colorway the black toes and then more recently the mystic green and also i also bought one extra one give me one second let me go grab it now this isn't part of the jordan one low sb collection but i bought this because i was so mad when this one released this right here in the back when that one released i wasn't able to cop it so this was basically like an impulse buy, like bam, I couldn't get those, so bam, I bought these. Uh, but for some reason, I know this is not part of the collection, but this is just me speaking my mind. This is actually a women's uh, Jordan 1 low. But out of every, out of all the collection, I still prefer the materials on these. I just wish this had more color. One other thing, for some reason, the University Gold colorway is the only one that had extra pair of lacings. So just putting that out there. All the other ones doesn't, but the Black University Gold does. And I wish, I wish all of them had extra pairs of lacing because what I would probably end up doing is have one color on one side and another color on the other. But yeah, there you have it guys major difference between all this is not part of it between all the uh, nike jordan 1 sb collection for this year i hope you guys like this video comment down below which shoe you prefer subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so yet and uh that's it for this video guys thank you guys for watching thank you guys for your support i highly appreciate or i greatly appreciate you guys and uh, i'll see you guys soon man peace